Well, autumn's back. <laughs> Never mind, it's Sunday tomorrow. It's Saturday today, Saturday the 4th of October 2014. 06. 42 hours, still British summertime. Raining, not heavily. Cool. Rain's supposed to disappear and be colder. Oh, good um, Tiny Rebel search. Uh, some of Weatherspoon's new ales. Gravity Station, meeting up with some young colleagues. Maybe some chips. Uh, oh, and the Chromebook test goes on. You know, the usual Saturday morning sort of thing. Yeah, I think I need to get it out of the rain now. That sound, that's the rain. And it's going to be like this till April 2015. Need a steady cam. Uh, in the distance, those lights, that's the Bargoid Flyer. As you can see, Flyer might be a little bit of a misnomer. video dull thing. I'm looking there and it says International Retail Festival counts for 185. That's the quality that I need. It's a shame you can't get a beer at 8 o'clock in the morning. Unlike a filly in Newport. Well parts of Newport. What does that make me? One of those people who need those tablets. Anyway, nine o'clock that was cranberry juice, that was cappuccino. This is, this full stop is full stop, lager full stop, by the Brewdog Brothers. It's a half because I'm working on my uniques. 920 at the moment. It's new, it's on new menu. Camera not gonna like it because it's keg. It looks nice. Nice bit of carpet there. It smells nice. Oh. <laughs> it's sharp, it's hoppy. Um, lagers should be hoppy, especially Pilsners. Um, go to a Pilsen in Czech Republic. That's not going to please your average lager drinker. It's cold. It's got a big finish. It's a B++. This is quality brewing. Thank you, Scotland. Sorry, Mr. Manning, forgot to mention the carpet. This is it. Anyway, second half of the day. And it's the second out of a keg of the day. So we kicked out the camera, no doubt. This is American IPA by Devil's Backbone at 5.2%. It's a bit it looks lager yeah. A very amber. It's cold. Oh, you can smell the hops. The hops are nice. Ooh. Complexity. Fruitiness. Hoppiness. Yeah, I see. Touch of grapefruit in there as well. Which will be from the hops, not from the grapefruit. Works well with coldness. Hats off to the Weatherspoon for those. Mm. Yeah, no, Scott could be right. We're approaching an A minus. I think B plus plus. It is very good, but it's not got that A ness. Oh, that sounds wrong. Sorry. Number three. Another half. Um, Rice Stone Cowboy, 5% Walk Wharf from the River Wharf Bank Brewery, brewed by people in Yorkshire. It's a rye beer. Mm. Mm. 
There are hops in it, and there's a hoppy finish, quite hoppy finish, but it's watery, and the body is watery. It's not a good one. If it wasn't for the finish, I'm just give it a B. It needs more body. The gravity station. Whilst listening to The Verge talking Windows 10. Look at the bottles. Okay, um, right to left. Number one. Wine lager. 4%. Spelt with a double L. It wails. Number two. The Black Book from Cafilli. Close to where I live. Number four, Seren Summer Wheat. And I've forgotten how strong it is. When I do the proper review, I'll find out. Memory going completely. Anyway, might as well do the review of the first one. Lager, double L, A G E R. From Wine Brewery, 4% alcohol by volume. Oh, this is one that looks at the lager fingers. I would give that a B. I don't know, it's got a sneaking taste of more of an egg than the lager. Okay, number two. It says looking over his shoulder from Kapili, the health experience. 5.3. I'll be falling off this chair asleep, having to be dragged out to share again. Anyway, dark, golden, dark, dark, no, it's not even the slightest bit golden, it's dark and creamy. Oh, that's nice. Extremely hoppy. And quite smoky. Where's Big Tone when you need him? B. Uh, number three, this is Summer Wheat by Seren, I think, 5.5% alcohol by volume. The sun is out. Hello, it's pouring down with rain earlier on. It smells of tea. Mmm. Mm. I would say if it didn't have there was honey in that. Maybe not, but it's um, it's a week beer. Not a great week beer, but it's a nice week beer. B plus. And back onto the Belgian. This is La Trappe. This is a double. This is seven percent alcohol by volume. Someone's going to be snoring tonight. Oh. Yes, indeed. Mm. Oh, that's really good. Full flavour, some B. I'm heading for some chips because I need some emergency calories. Yeah. I'm Brewdog. Brew dog. Brew dog. Brew dog. <laughs> Brasserie de la Seine, Tadas Cuba. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah. Uh, de la Seine means it's French and I just murdered the name. Uh, four and a half percent alcohol by volume. Oh, it smells nice. Starts off gently and then huge finish. Uh, really huge finish. And bitter. Really bitter. B. Yeah. 2010 Bone, the lowest spelled Bone, because the Belgians. Gers, marriage, perfect, perfect marriage. 
Old and Young Landex Oak Farts Very acidic A minus.